Hi guys, it's Riviak again, and welcome to Guns of Icarus Online. Uh, as I mentioned in uh, Project 1999 Episode 6, I wanted to get some of this uh, recorder for you guys, and I'm finally able to play it with my new computer. Uh, recording might be a different story. This is actually going to be take two of, <laughs> of me trying to record. Uh, last time I actually went as an engineer, and uh, typically I go as engineer or uh, pilot. Uh, so this time we're going to actually go as pilot just so we can get some more footage. Uh, I was getting a lot of freezing frames and things like that uh, last game. Hopefully we don't. Uh, hopefully I fix those issues. Um, so actually, you know what? We'll go as gunner just because they're less important. If we have big issues, then um, you know it won't be a big issue if we uh, if we lose connection or something like that. So uh, we're going to go gunner. Uh, we'll still be able to get some good footage as gunner. And uh, we're gonna hop right into it. So let's uh, let's find a match here. Uh, this one looks good. Let's go ahead and hop on this one. Uh, you see here, um, these are the names that people choose for their ships, and uh, and that's the type of ship that it is. So we got a, we're against a goldfish and a pyramidion, and uh, we got a pyramidion and mobula. I'm actually gonna hop over to the mobula because uh, well, no, they already got a gunner, so I'm gonna stay right where I was. But uh, the Mobula has a wider deck, so it's a little easier to see things. Um, that would probably be the best spot for me to be, actually. But that's okay. Uh, we'll hop on the Pyramidion. Now, uh, Pyramidions used to be a whole lot, um, I guess, a whole lot uh, more popular than they are now. Uh, simply because they uh, they used to pop these uh, like sniper guns up on a... Uh, up on the tops and they just you know keep their distance and just snipe away I think they nerfed that since I've come back to the game uh, which is probably a good thing because boy, every game you'd see just a ton of pyramidions so we're actually starting the game early uh, as you can see we're, it's just going to be me and the captain and two AI well now only just one AI um, got actually another gunner uh, he left so we're going to have two AI uh, the AI are probably going to be repairing a whole bunch while I'm uh, up there on the guns so I can uh, get a good view for you guys. I really should be an engineer right now, but again, I uh, don't want to get a bunch of video of uh, me just pounding on stuff. So here we go. Uh, match is going to begin here in 10 seconds, and you're going to get a good idea of what kind of game this is uh, pretty much right out of the gate. It's very, very steam, uh, steampunk. Um, and. Uh, so this is a Pyramidion ship, and uh, is, is this Pyramidion? I guess it is. But um, right here we got this uh, front gun here. Uh, he's also got other guns there on the side, and over there on that other side. Uh, that's going to be the balloon. you got to keep the balloon up. The engineer's got to keep the balloon up, got to keep the hole. This is going to be the hole node, node point where you repair the hole and things like that. Top bar is like its shields. Think of that as its shields. Bottom bar is its armor. Or I guess hole. And uh, basically the strategy is just to uh, hop into a gun while the captain uh, flies you pretty close. Maybe put on some good bullets. And, uh, and shoot at each other until, <laughs> until the other guy goes down. Now this game, I believe we're playing a... Um, oh boy, is that an enemy? I can't get a shot. Uh, you gotta turn more, man. Well, we're getting flamed. There we go. Oh, and there goes the gun. Alright. So we're already off to kind of a bad start here. We're gonna try to get this gun back up. There we go. We're gonna hop back in, and we're gonna start pounding away at this guy. Uh oh, arm fire. <laughs> so he's going to make sure we, he keeps this gun down. That gun that he's actually got on the front, that's probably what this guy should have on the front too. That's a very powerful, very strong gun. Uh, it does quite a bit of damage up close. Uh oh, we're getting pounded here. He's got more of a long range sword gun on his ship, so he really shouldn't be this close. There we go. Got the gun back up. Probably only going to get one shot. Yeah, <laughs> one shot off before it goes down. Wow, the engineers are actually, the AIs are actually keeping uh, stuff 
decently prepared for how, for how bad that we're getting hit here. Yeah, if you hear me clicking, that's because I click a lot. And I, you don't have to. You can actually hold it down and it'll keep going. I just feel like it's faster whenever I click. And that's it. We're down. Now, in this one, oh, yeah, it's a death match. So that means um, it's a kill to kill. Uh, first team to five kills wins. And uh, this one's going to be two versus two, but they had three versus three matches and things like that as well. So we're going to hop back on this gun, go ahead and switch out the ammo for burst rounds. Uh, I don't have Lamar bullets. Uh, Lamar would be ideal for a, uh, but you know, again, I don't play gunner very often. Um, I mean, it's good for getting views on things, but uh, and seeing the action and everything, but... I prefer uh, to, when I'm doing that. Oh, oh, there's a freeze. Uh, when I'm doing that, to be um, helming the ship, but we already got a captain, so I'm going to be a gunner, so I can get uh, get some of this footage for you guys. Hopefully, it comes out all right. All right. So when you're this far off, it's good to grab the spyglass and yeah, do this. You just want to click on them. That way, you can kind of. You know, get some target on some enemies there. Okay, looks like we're running for the hills. Yeah. See, it puts a little white outline around them. And you can zoom in with the uh, spyglass as well, with the mouse wheel. Um, let's go ahead and hop back on this gun up here. Because it looks like he's lining up for the Leviathan. And we'll see if we can... Oh, we lost him. We'll see if um, we can take some pop shots. Here we go. So let's go ahead and get our lead going. Okay, it looks like these bullets are going to be falling pretty drastically. We're going to have to aim up some. Oh, freezing again there. Okay. I can't even turn the gun far enough. He's out of range. This is a kind of a long range gun, dude. We gotta back up some. Okay, so I'm hit. Oh man, we're down. Yeah. So this guy's got the wrong gun on his ship here, um, on the front here, for his play style. If he wants to go in on guys, he really needs uh, something a bit more close range. Uh, that's the main thing about this gun, this game, though. Um, you could be the best player, the very best player at this game. Doesn't matter if your uh, crew isn't good, then you're not good. You're not well. You're not going to win anyway. Um, you, it's a very cooperative game. You really have to. Everybody has to really be on doing what they're supposed to be doing, things like that. Just like a real ship, which is why I like the game a, a lot. When especially when you're playing with folks who really know what they're doing. Um, then um, it can really get really, really fun, uh, really intense too. Well, I'm gonna take some pop shots, but he's going in close, so we're probably gonna have to jump on one of the other guns if he actually gives us a target on one of the other guns. Oh, and we're falling off the ship for some reason. Wow, how did that happen? Oh, hello, we're back. Oof. Let's hop back up on this gun here. Nope, no shot. Let's just try on this. And it's down. Do have a shot on it, but... All the guns are down. Okay. Well, that's not good. Let's get these back up. up here. Uh, maybe the side gun. Oh, it's down to Crap. Well, they're getting flamed on now. That flame, uh, it's really, really close range, but if you can get in with it and get the, the enemy ship out of position, then uh, it can, oof, man, it can really do some damage, especially on the balloons. You just keep it nailed on them balloons. They go all the way to the, especially if they're loaded to the ground, they just scrape their hole all on the ground. There we go. Now we got some long range shots, maybe. 
Sorry about that, guys. Uh, ran out of recording time, but we are back, and uh, he didn't miss anything. Uh, he's going in for the close range again, I think. We're just trying to take some pop shots off here. Uh oh, a little bit. Of, oh, yep, yeah, that's game. All right, so uh, you see here, I just got a commendation. Um, you can give commendations by just clicking that right there. Uh, that will uh, accommodate the uh, the person there. You can only accommodate one person. Uh, 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 well, you can only give each person one commendation. Uh, after that, uh, uh, you can't do it again. So um, always make sure you give uh, commendations to uh, to players you really feel deserve commendation. If if they haven't, uh, he didn't do anything bad. He's uh, just I don't agree with his layout, but uh, he definitely knows how to buy a ship and things like that. So we won't uh, begrudge him that. I'll go ahead and throw him a commendation. Now uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, lay it out here uh, again. Like I said, uh, this sniper is be, rifles. This is gonna be a short episode just because. Um, I just want to test it out. I want to see how it uploads to YouTube, see what it looks like. Uh, I want to thank you guys for watching. If you like uh, Guns of Icarus, or if you like this video, uh, definitely show me a like. Uh, that way I can uh, see that this is something you guys want to see. And if you want to see more matches and things like that, I can do uh, several matches per video or something like that. So let me guys uh, let me know what you guys think, and uh, I'll see you stockies in the uh, in the next video.